Delia Ali, one of England's brightest young stars at the moment, is playing for Tottenham Hotspur and he's playing incredible for his club. He's one of the best players in the Premier League and only being 21 years of age, Delia Ali has literally a full career ahead of him. It is insane to think how good he is going to be in his prime. And if he continues to progress like the way he is growing at the moment, he could go on to be a future English legend. He could be up there with the likes of Frank Lampard, Steven Gerrard, but that is if he continues the way that he is going at the moment. Can he be that driving force that goes ahead and wins Tottenham Hotspur the Premier League title in the upcoming years? We're all going to have to wait and find out. But today, I've got 10 things you probably didn't know about Dele Alley. If you do go on to enjoy today's video, make sure you go ahead and click that like button. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. Make sure you also click on that bell button so you can be a part of the notification squad. Number 10. He's a Liverpool fan. Dele Alli might be playing for Tottenham Hotspur, but he's a die-hard Liverpool fan. He was born and raised in Milton Keynes, but his football family lives with the red side of Merseyside. Alli's role model is actually Liverpool legend Steven Gerrard. And in an interview, he confessed that he used to buy his boots based on what boots his icon was wearing at the time. He also went on to quote, to be honest, I just tried to get whatever Steven Gerrard was wearing. Alli seems to have learned a lot from the English legend watching him play and it looks like from watching Steven Gerrard throughout all those years it has helped him out on the pitch. Number 9 early career. So Dele Alli was born and raised in Milton Keynes. He joined the youth system at Milton Keynes Dons. He broke into the team during the 2012-13 season and over the next two and a half years, he made 88 official appearances for the team, scoring 24 goals. He then signed for Tottenham Hotspur in February of 2015 for an initial fee of £5 million and that is insane to think that. The player that he is today and Tottenham only signing him for £5 million is incredible. They definitely Definitely got more than what their money was worth, being loaned back to the Dons for the remainder of the season. But he was brought back to Tottenham Hotspur, and during his first full campaign at White Hart Lane, Ali was voted the PFA Young Player of the Year, and he went on to win it again the next season. Number eight. Nigerian descent. Dele Ali is of Nigerian descent and he's actually eligible to represent the African nation, but he decided against it and chose to play for England. Ali had his sights set of representing England. From a young age, he made it into the under 17s national team. In 2012, and the older he got, it only meant that he represented England even more. He represented England in the under 18s, under 19s, under 21 competition, and now for the first team. Number seven. Adoption. Dele Ali had a really tough childhood growing up. His mother put him up for adoption when he was 13 years of age. She admitted in an interview with the son that she had problems with drugs and alcohol and felt it was the right thing to give him away. When Ali was five, he moved to Nigeria with his father, but immediately moved back to England within six months to live with his mum. In the interview, the mother said it was tough to give up my son, but it proved to be his salvation. I'm so thankful for how things have turned out. When he scored the goal against France representing England, I leapt out of my seat. I was so happy my son has made it by himself. I am so pleased for him and super proud of everything he has achieved. Number six, he features in a music video. Ali has been featured in a music video starring him and a few other Spurs players upon the request of an artist who goes by the name of Meriden Dan. He is a rapper and a mad Spurs fan. So when he wanted to make a music video, he turned to the club for help and they kindly obliged. Deli Ali, Eric Dyer, Kyle Walker, and Eric Lamella all appeared in the video song called Hot For Me Now. In the video, Ali shows off his juggling ability and he also includes some of the young stars of Spurs as well. Number five his best friends with Eric Dyer. Eric Dyer and Dele Ali, Spurs teammates and also English teammates. They have a great friendship on and off the pitch. The two stars often share tweets and jokes on social media, constantly making fun of each other. They play well together and it's definitely a friendship that is going real good at the moment. Number four, huge debut. We all know Dele Ali is a special talent and everyone was made aware of that fact 
with his performance against Real Madrid. Spurs manager Pochettino had become known for promoting youth and he saw something special in Ali that made him give the youngster his debut after he came back from his loan spell. Playing against lower division teams like Fleetwood Town and then suddenly being thrusted into a match against the best players in the world can be an intimidating experience but Ali did not let the occasion overwhelm him. When he did face Real Madrid, he wasn't just facing the best players in the world. There were 70,000 fans watching in the Allianz Arena during the friendly, showing that he can hold up in such big games and big tests. Number three, individual awards. So I thought I'll go through the individual awards of Dele Ali. He's already experienced success for himself. At a club level, he hasn't done too much. But when it comes to himself and the individual awards, it just shows you that this guy has won so much already at a young age. He was the Football League Young Player of the Month in August of 2014. He also won that in January of 2015. He was the Football League Young Player of the Year during the season of 2014-15. He was a part of the Football League One PFA Team of the Year yet again during that year of 2014-15. He won the BBC Goal of the Season during the year of 2015-16. He's a part of the Premier League PFA Team of the Year twice during the season of 2015-16 and 2016-17 and was also the PFA Young Player of the Year during the two seasons of 2015-16 and 2016-2017. And CC has come back from his loan spell, come back to Spurs, made it into the starting 11. He's gone on to be in the Premier League Team of the Year and has also been crowned the Young Player of the Year. Number two. Praises from others. Deli Ali has had a lot of praise in the past seasons at Tottenham Hotspur. Starting with the manager, Pochettino, he's gone on to say in the box, he looks like a striker. And outside the box, he plays like a midfielder. Rafael van der Vaar also went on to describe Ali as fast, fluid, and has a great skill set. While one of his idols, Frank Lampard, also praised Deli Ali's intelligence in his ability. He went on to say, to get inside the box without being marked is a skill that he does possess. And number one, changing kit name. So this is something that Ali did do not too long ago. Ali changed his kit name to his given name, saying that he had no connection to his legal surname due to his separation from his mother. The Tottenham Hotspur midfielder, Deli Ali, decided to change his name on the reverse of his match shirt from Ali to Deli due to feeling no connection to the Ali surname. At the time, the 20-year-old revealed the reason for the change was a personal one. He went on to say, I wanted a name on my shirt that represented who I am, and I feel I have no connection with the Ali surname. This is not a decision I have taken without a lot of thought and discussion with family close to me. And good for him, he's been able to overcome a lot in his life to go on to be one of the brightest England future stars that there is today. And I would love one day to see him go ahead and lift up the Premier League trophy. And I can't wait to see the player that he's eventually going to become. He can definitely go on to be an England great if he continues the road that he's going on at the moment. And that is the 10 things you probably didn't know about Delhi Alley. If you did enjoy this video, give it a like, subscribe if you are new to the channel, and I'll see you all on my next video.